Diving into the realm of language, let's explore the arsenal of linguistic assaults aimed at Byron Donald and the broader repercussions on political conversations. How much is APAC paying you, you bastard? That being said, how much is APAC paying you, you race traitor? Race traitor? Really? Yeah. So, my yeah. Yes. Uncle Tom, hey, 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 why hey, the United hey, States is supporting a Jewish supremacist country? Outside agitators aren't allowed. You're working for a foreign entity, you You're bastard. Outside 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 entity. Entity. Get him out of here, yeah. sir. Student. That guy's really old You're to be a college. Sir. Anyway, <laughs> you know, why the United States. Labeling dissenting anti Israel activists as race traitors or Uncle Tom represents a form of character assassination engineered to silence opposing voices within marginalized communities. The paradox arises when proponents of diversity and inclusivity resort to racial epithets to target African-American Republican representatives. In a democratic society where civil discourse and the appreciation of diverse viewpoints are paramount, such incendiary language only serves to deepen divisions and erode the foundations of constructive dialogue.